Hey everybody, welcome to Comics with Bueller. As always, I'm Bueller. Today is your preview video for all the new comics coming to comic shops and online for July 1st. 2020. We don't have a lot of books for you guys this week. Unfortunately, Marvel and DC both are taking the week off, but we do have Image, Boom, and a few others. If you're new to our channel, do me a favor, subscribe right now. It does help us out a lot. And also turn on that notification button because you're not going to want to miss our next video. Don't forget to go to Max Pro Supplies for all your comic book supply needs and the code Bueller at checkout and you save 10%. I want to say thank you to everybody who answered last week's question. We asked, do you think there is market manipulation going on in comics? You guys had a ton of responses. We talked about that on this week's copy video. It'll pop up right here. It debuted on Monday morning at 5 a.m. It was a great conversation. And you know what? It's something we are going to revisit in the near future. But this week's question is, do you think DC made the right decision dumping diamond distribution and going with other options? I want to hear from you. Leave a comment down below and we will talk about that on next week's copy video that comes out on Monday morning at 5 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Looking forward to reading those comments. Should be a great conversation. All right, everybody, let's not waste any more time. Let's go ahead and take a look at the books that are coming out July 1st, 2020. First up was All American Comics, number one. The Goddamned The Virgin Brides, number one. The Marked, number six, cover A and cover B. Nail Biters Returns, number two. Olympia, number five, love this book, cover A and cover B for that one. On the Stump, number three, cover A and cover B as well. Pretty Violent, number seven. Protector, number four. Reaver, number nine. And look at this next one. Negan Lives, The Walking Dead. This is a one shot. Kind of came out of nowhere. Really looking forward to this book for sure. Buffy the Vampire Slayer, number 15. This is Boom Studios. Jim Henson's Ghost, number three. King of Nowhere, number three, cover A. And we have cover B for that one. It's a good book. Ronin Island, number 12, cover A. And cover B as well. On to Dynamite, we have The Boys, Dear Becky, number two. The Death of Nancy Drew, number two. Vengeance of Vampirella, number eight, the main cover. And the cosplay cover. Hello. <laughs> Killing Red Sony, number two, the main cover. This one was supposed to be out a while ago. The variant cover. Hopefully it makes it out this week. Ghostbusters Year One, number four, cover A. This is IDW and cover B. I Can Sell You a Body, number four. Marvel Action Classic Avengers Iron Man, number one. Star Trek Year Five, number 12. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Urban Legends, number 24. Usagi Ojimbo Color Classic, number four. Backtrack number four, this is Oni Press. Midnight Sky number five, cover A, Scout Comics. And cover B, The Thing, that's pretty cool. Apocalypse Girl number four, Source Point Press. Touching Evil number six. Skyland number one, not sure if that's going to make it either. Storm Kids Hyperbreed number two. The Plot number five, cover A, this is Vault. And cover B is pretty cool looking. That's the FOC variant. Bella vs. Black Knight, number one, cover A, this is Xenoscope. Cover B, some great looking covers for this book. You gotta give them credit. Cover C, and then cover D is probably my pick. Yeah. <laughs> Kids, number four, main cover, this is by a Blaze. And the one in ten foil cover, some shiny goodness. Cover B, and then we have cover C, I like that one. And of course we got cover D, so quite a few to choose from on that one. Sweetheart number two. Dark Red number 10, this is Aftershock. Billionaire Island number two, cover A. 
And cover B, I believe this is Ahoy Comics. The Goon, number 11, cover A. And cover B for that one. Albatross, I think. Ghost Wolf, number 4, Amigo Comics. Nancy and Hill, number 1. This is a one-shot, I believe. Ezekiel Him Zombie Hunter, number 2. Wolvenheart, number 7, Mad Cave. Project Icarus number four, Black Box Comics. Last one, Devil's Highway number one. Hey everyone, welcome back. Hope you saw something you like. Like I said, not that many books this week. Marvel, DC, both took the week off. That really kind of sucks to be totally honest, but they will be back next week, so that should be good. All right, don't forget to answer the question. Like I said, do you think DC made the right choice dumping Diamond Distribution and going with other options? We want to hear from you. All right, everybody, thank you so much. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You know what to do. I'll see you next time. Bye.